Yes, sir. Yeah, man. Um, God bless the soul, bro. Uh, October 22nd, 2018. October 22nd, 2018. Yep. All right. And look, I got this, this right here. It, it's for her. You feel me? Right here. Mm -hmm. This this part right here. And that's her signature. That's the last place she kissed me, bro. Six weeks before she died, G. Wow, man. And that's powerful. So you know why that, that's so powerful. And I'm glad you was one of the last features because, you know, my son's mom in here neither. And you know what I'm oh, saying? I didn't know like, that. Yeah, she passed in uh October of 2017. So, Man, bro, I'm sorry. I did not know that. Yeah, so, so it's just like it's just me and him and uh, the breast cancer and all that. So I, I I wanted to mention that because you and him got a connection greater than y'all think. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy, bro. Who know what that's like? You know what I'm saying? It's supposed to be the other way. Right. I don't want it to go either way. But yeah. I yeah. respect how you still move um, ha after having lost your mom out here. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, um, that's another key thing I wanted to make sure I bring up. And and like how how you do that so well? You know what I'm saying? Like I know you got the tattoos, but how you keep her alive? How you you know what I'm saying? Because I know you get them down things where you think of her. Or, you know what I'm saying? Like like how you how, yeah. how you yeah. It's all positivity, bro. All right. It's all you know what I'm positive. saying? It's, it's all positive. Man, I'm trying to, man, with me, bro, like, one thing I done learned in this life, G, is everything in life is about perspective. You feel me? Like, for one person, you know, death is, is um, you know, is, is despair. It's, it's, it's mourning. It's a lot of that. And for me, it was, too, in the beginning. But I had to realize, like, she built me like this to think a little more critically and evaluate situations a little differently than most so that you can navigate them rough waters and then once my mom makes basis same shit was bro get to the point and then you can reflect later you feel me so i try not to get too caught up in emotions you know and sometimes you gotta let it you gotta go through that but once you can't let yourself get lost in that you can't become uh trapped in that you feel me at some point you got to move on and start to do what that person you lost really wants you to do you feel me which is be the best version of you you can be that's all i can do bro you know what I'm saying? And like my son too, right now, my son, he has a uh, epilepsy, you know, uh, disorder. So he has seizures and whatnot. And that's a whole nother thing. Me and my wife and my family is trying to navigate because that shit is new on us, bro. Like this shit just started happening. He 18. It's just started happening three years ago, bro. He was perfectly healthy, had asthma. That was it. One day, 15. Man. Wow. Now fell out, had a seizure, but had a seizure soon, bro. Wow. 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 Man, that's even another layer to being a good father, right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Man, bro, it's a full-time job, G. <laughs> and overtime. 